Elders say that tundra plants can be used as medicine. Plants like stinkweed and tundra can help heal the mind, body, and soul. But why don't more people know about their healing powers? We traveled to two villages to learn more about how plants can help. During our travels, we met Mary Tunuchuk, a retired teacher who uses traditional medicine, and Agnes Gareyayrok, who uses traditional medicine too. We met Peter Paul, a veteran who is healing his asthma with willow plants, and Ben Flynn, a man who was chosen to be a traditional healer. The knowledge of medicinal plants can't fade away. The next generation needs to know how to heal themselves too. It helps me heal inside where I'm sick. Like if I have a cold, it'll help me cure my cold and it'll also make me healthier. Peter Paul is a close friend of my father. My grandmother told me that she had a feeling that Peter Paul needed willows from the Kaskokim to help him heal. She collected them and my dad brought them to him. Ever since then, Peter's wife has cooked the willows into a broth and he drinks them to improve his health. The traditional plants help me to heal my health because I get the asthma. And uh, your uh, grandma sent me some from upriver, the uh, Bushy Willy, and my wife cooked them and then I was uh, drinking them I, because it's, it's a strong medicine. So I eased it off with two teaspoons, but it still works for me and I'm still living. There's some chaikyuk too that uh, we use even for infections, like if you have a cut and all that stuff. Even drink it if you have uh, infection on your teeth. Traditional healers are especially knowledgeable when it comes to medicinal plants. They can heal people who are sick, depressed, or have broken bones. According to Ben Flynn, traditional healers are chosen. They'll experience strange things happening to them throughout their lives. Eventually, they come across creatures in the tundra that give them special powers. He described his own story to us. I took a first hair and I saw a crack about two inches. Fingers could fit to, through the cracks. And then uh, when I opened it, there were like uh, maggots. They were clean, pure clean maggots. Mm -hmm. My mom used to tell me about those, if I ever see those kind of any insects, they used to lay their hands over them and they would become a healer, a healer of broken bones or healer of uh, ailments, any types of ailments. So I tried that. I could feel the electric waves going up to my elbow slowly, both of them. They were like electric, electricity. Ever since his experience on the tundra, Ben Flynn had the ability to cure people who need help. Both modern and traditional medicine is useful. Many years ago, our ancestors' medicines were plants from the land. While there are times when modern medicine is needed, Perhaps we should first turn to medicine that is easily picked and easy to get to. The modern medicine um, gives you uh, allergy reactions if, you, if you're not used to it. And um, it may be the wrong medicine. It might not help you. But the um, traditional medicine, since it c come from uh, Mother Earth, it can help you. It can cure you and it doesn't give you re um, allergy reactions. I read all this uh, medication that uh, they have, uh, the side effects that uh, modern medicine, the doctors gave us. Every one of them has side effects that uh, either help you or make you worse, but uh, these traditional medicines, uh, uh, they have the same things, like you can get over those on them, but you can control those, like you see, I can, use uh, uh, two teaspoons of uh, Pussy Willy. 
I know for sure there's nothing in the traditional medicine that somebody else put in there. Uh, it's naturally grown from outside, so I know they're, they're safe. And they don't work that fast or strong, but they do work. I uh, want the people to know is that the younger generation to try to understand the traditional medication that the people use back then to this day that can work, that help your health out. The words that come from our elders are meaningful and true. The next generation will need to know how to use medicinal plants from the tundra. If they don't know who will teach them, everyone should know that nature can heal. I believe these traditional things will help these young teens, young people, 